Hi everyone, I'm Bobby Seagull. I'm an author, TV presenter and maths teacher. I'm also proud to be an ambassador for the charity National Numeracy. Together, we help children and grown-ups feel good about numbers. Feeling confident about numbers helps you throughout your life, both now and in the future. Do you know that you use numbers all the time, at home and at school? Not just in maths lessons. If you're baking a cake, playing a sport, making music, dancing, or doing some creative crafting, you're using numbers. Can you think of any ways you use numbers in your favorite activity? One of my favorite activities is stargazing. On a dark night, I love looking up at the sky, counting the stars, and seeing if I can spot any planets. And there are so many numbers in space. How long will it take to reach the moon? How much fuel do we need to get there? So, we're going to have some fun with numbers today and build our very own Number Block 10 space rocket. Before we start, I have a few tips that are great for building rockets and for maths. Tip number one, take your time. Sometimes we feel like we need to do things quickly, like building a rocket or answering a maths question. But it's not a race. Take your time and you'll get there in the end. And if it takes a bit longer, that's okay. Tip number two, take it step by step. Building a rocket or tackling a maths problem is a lot easier if you break it down into small bite-sized blocks. Tackle one block at a time and before you know it, you finish the whole thing. Tip number three, keep going. Even if you make a mistake, you can go back and repeat the previous step if you need to. It's the same with maths. You can try again if you don't get it right the first time. We all make mistakes, it's completely normal. Okay, shall we get started on our number block 10 rockets? Yes! Ready? You need to print out your template sheet from the National Numeracy Day website. You'll also need some scissors, glue, a red, dark red and grey pen, or any three colours, white primer paint, and a rectangular shaped plastic bottle, roughly 25 centimeters high. Don't worry if you don't have a plastic bottle. You can use anything rectangular shaped, maybe a shoe box, a cardboard milk container, or a piece of cardboard folded into a rectangle. I'm ready to go. Let's start with the first step. Step one, take your plastic bottle and pour the paint into the bottle. Place on the lid and shake to cover the inside of the bottle in paint. If you're using a different cardboard item, you can paint the outside white. Step two, two. color in the templates on your printout sheet. Step three. three, cut out the template, include the slit on the side panels and the lines inside the tab on the rocket wings. Ask a grown-up if you need help. Step four. four, push the rocket wing through the slit in the side panel. Alternatively, fold the tabs out and stick to the back of the panel. Repeat for both sides. Step five, five. stick the side panels to the sides of the bottle. Step six, six, draw the lines on the front and back of number block 10 to mark out her 10 blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Step seven, seven. stick number block 10's legs to the bottom. Step eight. eight. Fold and glue together number block 10's helmet. Step nine. nine, push the helmet onto number block 10's head. And that's the final step. Your number block 10 rocket is finished 
and ready to blast off on a space adventure. Blast off! That was so much fun. I'd love to see your number block 10 rockets. Ask a grown up to share a photo or video of your rocket on social media using the hashtag National Numeracy Day. Happy National Numeracy Day, everyone!